you, Team Lindsay. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to check out The Glee Project on Facebook and on Twitter and like my fan page. <laughs> when I started becoming involved with The Glee Project, I was just a little junior college student in a small town without any reputation at all. <laughs> um, and I just kind of auditioned with the hope of getting my feet wet. I never really expected it to go anywhere. So to be here and to go this far, um, definitely was in the stratosphere. I never, ever, ever thought I would be sitting here talking to you guys. Um, but, you know, the best piece of advice that I've been given throughout the Glee Project um, has been from Robert Ulrich. And he always says, be yourself no matter what, even if people not like people might not like you or you don't think it'll be accepted, always be yourself. That's what Glee's about and that's how um, you should live your life. Um, I would say on the Glee Project, the most challenging thing was either vulnerability because it was very hard to kind of rip ourselves open and and put ourselves in that emotional state or tenacity uh, I loved being slushied but it's not easy it's hard when you get hit with something cold and your body wants to stop and you have to keep going so yeah vulnerability and tenacity definitely the hardest Brittany Jackson hello um, my favorite guy on the show is Zach Woodley uh, he is just incredible as a mentor and as a person you walk into his studio you know his rehearsal room and can't help but smile he'll yell at you but you're like okay <laughs> he's just if you ever meet him give him a hug he's amazing he's the best guy i know zoe watson tips on keeping a good long high note uh one believe that you can do it because that's half the battle uh there have been many times when i go to sing or belt a high note and don't think i can do it and then my voice will falter and crack and i just embarrass myself but um definitely one believe that you can do it uh breathe deeply push from the right places in your diaphragm and never sing with your throat because it'll tear your vocal cords to shreds so keep practicing ali covens uh you're asking if hannah and i are ever going to do another cc and dd we i don't know what's wrong with us we totally planned on doing it and it didn't happen so you have every right to hit us for procrastinating, but I promise, I pinky, double pinky swear that there will be a CC and DD. I double pinky swear. And I will tell her that we need to do it. <laughs> so it will happen. It's been interesting watching um, my, my own self on the Glee Project. It's strange because I've never seen myself on film before, um, but it's awesome because it's like having a big scrapbook of memories of the things that we went through together as a family. I do keep in touch, uh, obviously, with Hannah. We're roommates. Um, but yeah, we. I mean, I talk to Damien, I talk to Cam, I talk to Sam. Sam lives in Los Angeles with us. Mateus, Bryce lives in Los Angeles. I talked to Ellis on Skype the other day. I have to find her a pair of orange pumps. Don't let me forget that. Um, and uh, I talked to McKinley. She got a sunburn last time I talked to her. And yeah, I just saw Marissa and uh, Emily just had a really awesome show in New York, so we've been we've definitely been keeping in touch. From the producers of Glee, the Glee Project, so new every Sunday at 9, 8 Central, only on Oxygen. Live out loud!